Hey guys, what's up? Trucker Chris here, co-CEO of DC Trucking. Uh, uh, welcome back to another video. It's been a long time since I've done one of these. That's my coffee. Anyway, today we're going to be driving from Hanover to Hamburg, which is where our company is based in Hamburg. You know, copper roof gutters in this trailer here, I don't know if you can see it. Where our company is making eight grand for delivering it, so yeah, taking it to a construction site. I don't know if you could tell, but I am using the uh, new, uh, the new what is it called, the contracts feature in World of Trucks. So let's get on with our delivery here. I have the winter mod on. Oh, for or a frosty mod, but it's kind of like a winter mod. It's a mod, it's, kind, it's like a winter mod that doesn't really mess around with the physics. Um, it was shown to me by, it's kind of snowing out, by a YouTuber who does Zero Truck called Squirrel. Uh, I don't know if you know who Squirrel is. He's a really good Euro Truck YouTuber. Uh, it's the I should probably indicate. Shit. He is a YouTuber who, who does great Euro truck videos and live streams. He is really good. Don't know if you realize. Oh shit. Don't want to hit the freaking guardrail. Alright. It's, it's kind of dark out. There's no more uh, illumination here. I think the snow is starting to stop. So I'm gonna need my high beams. Anyway, um, just gonna update you with with, with uh, what's been going on at DC Trucking. Uh, it's good coffee. All right, you gotta be careful around right here. Uh, anyway, a couple of drivers. Uh, I will not say any names, but a couple of drivers were fired because they never submit any deliveries, never logged anything in the log book, so unfortunately I don't like having to do this, but me and David had to fire a couple of employees. We only have, I think it's like 13, 14 drivers working at DC Trucking now. It's ridiculous. We had 20 drivers working for us at one point, and a lot of them got fired unfortunately because they never submit deliveries. So that's kind of unfortunate. I don't like having to fire employees, but they can't comply with our rules. As uh, I don't know if you know, but we have a rule of one delivery a month. These drivers who got fired went a whole month without submitting a delivery. So we had to fire them. Right, going around this bend here. I'm going to try not to tip my truck because I don't want to. I don't want to crash. Unlike some people, you know, lots of people I don't like crashing because I take this very seriously. This is not a game to me. This is real life. That's how I see it. And if you don't like that, then, well, I suggest you don't treat it the same way I do. You know, I treat it like it's real life. I pretend this is real life. Maybe I don't like the way you treat it, for all, for however that may be. So, if you don't like the way I treat things here, then why don't you go treat things the way you want to? And I'll treat things the way I want. Anyway, uh, we have uh, our new truck that's a fit, the official truck of DC Trucking, which I will give instructions on how you can get provided with one. I'll cut off the high beams, you don't need them here. Actually, second thought, you need them. <laughs> no more Illumini lights. Anyway, the new Mercedes Benz Actros, which is what I'm driving here is now the official truck of DC Trucking. Yes, the official truck is the new Mercedes Actros. It's like a real life truck, trucking company. We use Mercedes Actroses at our company. This is the company we supply our drivers with. Now, if you're wondering how you can get a Mercedes Actros if you work at DC Trucking, first of all, you have to work at DC Trucking in order for, for us to provide you with a truck. Um, what you do, the cheap lip, is 
you eat, you get your profile from you know, your Euro Truck Simulator to documents profiles. You should profile should be in there, and you email it to David and Chris Trucking at gmail.com. Now I'll repeat that: David and Chris Trucking at gmail.com. That is the company email. You email your profile to that to, to that email address. And uh, you will receive. Uh, and when and when we get that, we will we will edit your profile and um, we'll edit it and we'll provide you with an ad trust. Then we'll send it back to you, and then you get your profile back and you have a brand new Mercedes Benz ad trust. Are you gonna let me in, dude? You gonna let me in? No. Well, I'm just gonna bully my way in. I noticed one thing with the uh, the, the four wheelers in a Euro truck here is uh, if they won't let you in, you kind of like move in at them, and then they start to back off. You know, not a very polite, courteous thing to do, but but it's the only way to get into a lane that you need to be in. That I noticed. Like I've seen truckers do it in real life to people who are, who won't who won't let them in. You know, people who just match their speed and you drive right beside them and match their speed and prevent them from changing lanes. I've seen truck drivers like just push, kind of push the, the four-wheeler out of the way. So they can't say it's unrealistic. I think my sister was singing before. Sorry about that. Uh, where are we on the map? We're almost in Hamburg. Almost at Sam Builders Hamburg. That's good. Hope this video is not too long. It's a pretty big drive day. It's actually a longer drive than I thought it would be. The video may cut out at some point. That's because I have a 12 minute limit on my camera. So if the video cuts out right in the middle of it, I'm, I'm very sorry about that. But my camera only allows me to record 12 minutes. So... If it cuts out, I'm sorry. You know, there's nothing I can really do about it. Dude, it's just the type of camera that I have. I have a Sony CyberShot, and those uh, only allow 12 minutes of recording. It's pretty retarded, I know, but... Yeah. Anyway. Oh, well, what's going on here? Looks like we've got a traffic jam. Anyway, we also uh, now have our official home base of our company is in uh, Hamburg, Germany. Yep, the home base of DC Trucking is in Hamburg, Germany here, in, uh, in Euro Truck. Even though we are an American company, like my friend, like I'm Canadian and uh, my friend and business partner David M. Griffith, he's American. We're an American company, but DC Trucking and Euro Truck. Our main headquarters for Euro Truck is in Hamburg, Germany, which is where I'm going right now. I can show you the yard if my camera will allow it. Come on, dude, you can go a little faster. I'm a truck. It's, I hate how they like the speed limit is 40 on these on on these uh, on and off ramps, and the AI actually complies with that. I hate that so much. I hate how they comply with the speed limit. There. Uh, oh yeah, you're gonna go in that lane. I'm gonna have to pass ya, Mr. Coach Driver. God, I hate coach drivers. Like nothing against coach drivers, you know. I'm sure it's a, it's, a, it's an okay job, just like truck drivers are. But you know, coach drivers aren't very nice and uh, not very nice to me. Let's just say that. Not very courteous. I honked that one uh, earlier. Alright, just gonna pass that guy who seems to be struggling. Poor guy. He must have a very underpowered truck. Um, oh shit, I just spilled coffee all over me. Fuck. It's great. I just spilled coffee all over me. That's wonderful. Yeah, it certainly is. Anyway, 
uh, if you work at DC Trucking and you want your new Atrocin just to... Oh shit, red light! Oh, stop! <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Actually, the braking power of this Atros is pretty good. All things considered, you know, in my old Scania, you know, it would, it would have taken me a, a while to stop. I'm gonna put the high beams off, because we're in the city, and technically it's illegal to use your high beams in the city. You can get charged for that, so... Not gonna. I don't want to cost DC trucking money. Just because I had to do something stupid. Oh, I'm actually having some good luck with these traffic lights. Normally they're all red. I guess Hamburg is in a good mood and wants... Why are there no street lights here? And I'm not gonna show you me parking because that'll probably take too long. This one's red. I'm just gonna arrive at the place and I'm gonna end the video there. It's right around the corner here. Here we are, Sand Builders. Sand Builders Construction. Appear, they appear to be building something. Anyway, I'm just gonna park right here. I'm gonna park in the trailer later. After I, rec after I finish recording. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you did. And subscribe to the DC Trucking YouTube channel for more videos like this. See ya.